moment of truth, I guess. <laughs> What's up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today, I'm building a boat. I'm building a boat out of cardboard, flex seal, and duct tape, and I'm gonna sail it. I'm gonna sail it down a river. All right, so I picked up a bunch of cardboard boxes. This is gonna be the wood of the boat. I got some flex seal tape here because this is going to waterproof all my seams. That'll be awesome. A bunch of duct tape to wrap it all together. This will hold everything together just fine, I know. Ow! God! Oh man, I hate that. I noticed you uh, have gloves on now. Uh, yeah, I learned my lesson the hard way. All right, I feel like the best way to go about this is to create a boat out of Oh, line. like a diamond, yeah, yeah, that's a good idea. Yeah, like this, yeah. That's the move, right? That's the move, all right, so I gotta duct tape this together. I'm never gonna be able to duct tape with this. <laughs> ah, another one! For the duct tape? For the tape! I hate it! Building boats is maybe not what I'm cut out for. Nice diamond shape. This will be our bottom. Flex seal this all up and then cover it in duct tape. So we're plugging up some portholes here. There's some handles in the boxes that are causing a problem. This right here, that'll cause problems later on. So we gotta button those up quick. So the bottom is done. We just gotta get a floor built in this thing. Best thing to do is to fold all these walls in to strengthen the walls of the boat. I think this is gonna work. I think it's gonna work too. I think this is gonna be freaking awesome. It's a lot cheaper than buying a real boat too. Not much cheaper, but pretty cheap. We have reinforced the inside of the boat. I think that this thing is gonna sail. We have a nice heavy bottom with layers and layers of cardboard and tape. We've reinforced the sides. I think we just gotta wrap the outside up and waterproof it a little more, and I'll be ready to hit the sea. The boat is finished. We built an oar, and we got this hook on here so we can drop an anchor or tie myself to shore just in case this thing decides to go rogue. It's looking pretty sweet, pretty professional. I think 99% uh, chance that this thing's gonna float. All right, the boat is finished. We're heading on down to the water. Look at this. It fits in my car perfectly. I should get my engineering degree because I'm good. It's, it's got a good, good amount of weight to it. Pretty heavy for being cardboard, but that's probably all the duct tape. Floats. The moment of truth, I guess. Whoa. Whoa. Oh. Oh. Are we good? Yeah. Is it holding? Yeah. I forgot to take my phone out of my pocket. That's working. Is it leaking at all or no? I don't know if it's necessarily leaking. There's water in it from when I tipped a little, but it's floating. <laughs> I can't believe it works. Oh <laughs> I'm trying to push this out. <laughs> oh. 
He's in. Super sick. It works. It works. Oh. I can't believe it works. All right, so there you have it. The boat floats. It floats. Cheaper than a regular boat. It's a lot of cardboard and a lot of duct tape. Three rolls of flex seal. It's still pretty expensive to make. It's not the most eco-friendly. Well, yeah, there it is. That's all I got.